Hello everyone, I just wanted to make a quick tutorial today to show you how to format your SD card if it is over 32 gigabytes to work for your 3D printer. Um, I know this works for Creality at least. Uh, the main problem is, is when you try to format it with Windows, it only gives you the XFAT and the NTFS file system. So, as we can see, if we format it with that file system and eject it, then turn on our 3D printer over here. I'm going to go ahead and insert the SD card. As we can see, it says card inserted. And if we go down to our settings, it still says no TF card. So what we want to do to fix that is we'll go ahead and take it back out of the printer, turn the printer off just for sound. Then plug the SD card back into the computer. And the program that I like to use to get this done is Rufus, which is free program. You can actually just Google Rufus and it's usually the first link at the top. And what it is, it is it allows you to create bootable USB drives and I've used this in the past to make Linux USB drives. But go to their website, go down to their download link. Uh, it's only one megabyte. You can also get the portable version if you don't want to install it. But click on their download link, open up the install file, uh, give it a second, you'll be prompted to allow the install. Click yes if you want to then you'll have your Rufus format settings so what you want to do now is select your 64 gig SD card make sure you're selecting the SD card you want to format you want to go to non bootable and partition to NBR um, this is fine BIOS so we have our 64 gig SD card and what we want to make sure is that we're on the large FAT32 file system so Windows no longer allows you to do this with these for some reason, but Rufus allows you to easily. So we click start, hit OK because we want to format the drive. It'll delete the partitions, delete everything on the SD card while it's doing it. Then it'll open up the newly formatted 64 gig. What I do is I remove the files that Rufus installs. And then we'll go to properties just to make sure it's the right file system which is FAT32 file system, hit OK. Now we'll drag this G-code of a Bulbasaur over here just to make sure that our printer can read it. We'll eject our SD card. Turn back on our 3D printer. And then we insert the SD card are inserted and we go down to now it says print from TF and we have our Bulbasaur model and we can start printing. Hope that helps people. I know there's been paid software to do this or other workarounds but this is the easiest I found and there wasn't doc much documentation online so if it helps somebody I hope it helps at least one person. Thank you.